Well, new research shows the Australian summer is getting longer and winter is getting shorter. The Australia Institute has found some attempts were experienced for a full 31 days longer from 1999 to 2018 compared back to the 1950s. It's warned the extended summers will have a significant impact on the country's tourism, construction, mining sectors as well. So joining me now, Richie Mersey and the director of the uh, Climate and Energy Program. Uh, Richie, just, uh, just elaborate on some of that detail, uh, if you wouldn't mind, and uh, the kind of research that's gone into it. Sure. So, so what we did was relatively simple. We just looked at what the average temperatures were at the start of summer in early December and at the end of summer in late February in the 1950s and 1960s. And we took that as sort of the traditional summer and then we looked at when those average temperatures actually occurred in the last 20 years. And what we found, as you mentioned, is that summer has now started earlier and it's finishing later. Is there On a... average across Australia... Go, go, go it's ahead, Richard. longer. Mm. Oh, no. On average across Australia, as you mentioned, it's about a month longer and this has a number of impacts across many different sectors. Okay. And is there a trend in any part of that 20-year period, perhaps at the front end or perhaps at the back end? Uh, well, the, the trend has been continuous since the 1950s, and we looked at a number of different 20-year periods. But we looked at the most recent 20-year periods just to give people more of a real um, assessment of what they're feeling is tied into what the temperature gauges are showing over the last 70, 80 years. I mean, if you're in your 70s and 80s, like, like some of your watches, then really the, the summers you experienced as your childhood are no more. They're far longer and they're hotter. And this is, according to the Bureau of Meteorology, a consequence of climate change. And uh, are there any particular parts of the country that are feeling it more than others? Yeah, there are some areas and some regions that, that, that really have ramped up. Uh, Sydney is experiencing 38 days more summer. If you look at the last 20 years, some places like Port Macquarie, seven weeks more summer. And look, if you look at just the last five years where we've had some of the hottest years, uh, then summer and winter have changed dramatically. In fact, summer is now twice as long as winter. So all these things added up are just part of the picture for what climate change looks like, what a one degree increase in warming looks like and ultimately this will continue according to the bureau these costs of inaction unless australia and many other polluters take more okay richie mersey and thank you my pleasure